from Hi-Fi Collective here. Um, this wonderful looking amp is the new TU8888 from Eddie Kit. Um, it's a push-pull monoblock, so you're gonna need two. Um, we have just received 10 pairs. It's limited edition. Um, they provided us with one already built, which is brilliant, and it's got it's only available with Lundahl output transformers, which um, they're always incredible. Um, have a look at our video of our vid visit. We went to Lundahl's, Lundahl factory in Sweden a couple of weeks ago. Superb products and lovely people. So here we have it. It's um, to outline, it's a push-pull. So you basically have to have a preamp to run it. There is at the rear a level adjust so you can tune it to your sensitivity that you want uh, that matches your kind of your preamp. Um, the input valves here, you've got um, an EF86 um, and then the ECC82 is the, the phase splitter. And then on the output, there's multiple valves you can use. I fitted the KT120s from um, Tung Sol. I mean, to read the list off, you can use 6550, KT88, KT90, KT120, KT150, KT170, I'm sure there's more. With the KT170, you can actually get 60 watts, so it's pretty heavy powered. Um, frequency response is 10 to 50K, um, very low noise, 50 microvolts. So there's only one RCA jack at the back to play it. Um, and that's about it. It's You have to buy it yourself. So I'm gonna do that now just to show you. Um, cool. So we're now going to adjust the bias. Very, very simple. So let me just start. It basically recommends from you toggle, you turn the A um, anti-clockwise to low and you can see the needle is kind of flat. It recommends you turn it on for about five six minutes before you do any of this. This has been on for, for longer. So I'm gonna basically turn the screwdriver until it hits the green section, the middle of the green section. Now you might occasionally have to just adjust it. Oh, and you wanna get in the middle of it. So slowly, turny, turny. So it's in the middle, there you go. Um, and then the next one to do is the IP balance. So you have to press this button here and actually it's, it's on that green, you can see it, but I'm gonna show you how it works. You just do that and turn it until it gets in the green. So you might wanna check your levels. So when it's, the button's not pressed, obviously it's just, you have to look at the top part. And that's, that's great, so it all works. Um, let's play some music. Right, so before we put some music through her, this is a Celestian Ditton 44, my own speaker. We've done some upgrades in big sound. I love it. So that is wired up to, we, you can actually do 4M and 8 ohm, which I may have mentioned. You can also adjust the level going in and out, but you wouldn't use that as a volume control because it's at the back, it's just annoying. Um, so Johnny, hit play on the, So I'm adjusting the level at the back, you see? And then I'm adjusting the i-fi thing I've got here. There you go. our videos like and subscribe and follow us on all the social network platforms see you later